Much love, family. It's your boy Mills, and today I'm about to be getting into why black relationships fail. So, boom. So, I'm going to be talking about the males and the females, and, you know, I, I'm going to talk for males because I'm a male, and I'm going to talk from my perspective, and I'm not a female, but I, I am very understanding. You know, I grew up around females all my life, so I, ha I have pretty decent psychology of femininity of mindset, you know. So, boom, right? So, a man... You got to understand this, ladies. Men been psychologically programmed all their life to think that the girls on TV shaking their ass in all these videos since the 90s, 80s and shit, right? That's how a girl's supposed to look. This one I'm talking about right here. This is Nicki Minaj in 2000 and 2015. You can see the, see the clear difference, right? You feel me? This is what they program us to like. They want us to want the 2015 girl. So when we get with the real 2000 girl, we think, you know, she unattractive. Girl's supposed to look. Most of them, one is probably trannies. And, 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 and nine times out of ten, they got some type of uh, uh, work done that's not revealing a true figure, right? So now we see, see that shit all our lives. Now when we get what a female that she look how she's supposed to look, right? We think that, you know, we still attached to that fantasy, fictitious belief of what a woman should look like. So now we doing all this rah-rah shit. We still cheating on the low. That's why a man could a love. It's weird, bro. Yeah, like if you're not a male, you don't understand. A male could love a girl and still go have sex with another girl. It's weird. That shit weird. You know how y'all crave Food, you know how when you on your menstrual cycle, you crave food, and it's like you feel that shit, like you 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 gotta have it. It be like that sometimes with males, especially when you first starting out, when you younger, <clears throat> and, and you new to having sex. It, you know, you just want it all the time. So it's it's something like that. It, it, it's similar to that. So you gotta, and when you compare and contrast that, now you gotta, uh, you could grasp how you know it, it bad it could, you know the, the you know wanting to have sex as a man can be. We gonna be mature here, right? So. You know, bear with me. So now I'm gonna get on the, the women. Women, all their life, they've been programmed to believe that, you know, they've been watching Cinderella and Snow White all their life. So, and all these Disney movies and these, these fictitious beliefs of what a man should be. And this is what I'm talking about right here. As you see, Prince Charming putting on a glass liberal on Cinderella. And this is where the materialistic part of toxic femininity comes in. This is not all black queens. And this is not even us. These are Europeans. We don't be seeing us in the, in, the, in these cartoons back in the day. So this is now we want European love and not our black um, African Egyptian love. You feel me? But anyway, we're going to get into it. We're going to talk about it. It's this knight in shining armor who going to carry your way through life. And, and you ain't got to do shit. And he going to sweep you off your feet. Right? That's literally how they portray damn near every princess. So, you know. Anyway, that's uh that's what is you know the, the a lot of females expect from a man to pay for everything. A lot of females really think like that. A lot of men could feel like, damn, all she wants is for me for my money. And then a lot of times, all, all a lot of women all feel, damn, all he wants is for, is for me is, is, is sex. So it's like it, it's it's give and take, but you know everybody play their role. You, I'm I'm gonna go for the solution. We know the problem now. I'm all I'm all about the solution. So boom. This is my solution to all this shit, right? For men, we gotta understand that we gotta we gotta stop disrespecting our women. We gotta stop disrespecting them. We gotta, as a whole, we gotta stop this separation of dark skin, brown skin, and light skin. That shit is stupid. We all one race. Two dark skin people can make a, a light skin baby. It is possible. Two white people can't make anything darker than themselves. That's uh one thing. Another thing is for men, we gotta stop disrespecting our women. We gotta stop talking about, you know, oh, oh dear, yeah, fucking bitches, this and that, da da da. Like, like all women is 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 sex. All she, all they valuable, I, all they valuable for is shaking ass and and and, and it's having sex with you. So, you know, so that's gotta, that shit gotta go immediately. That shit gotta go. Now for women, y'all gotta most of y'all gotta get out the uh, fictitious belief that a man going carry your way through life. You gotta do shit too. It's equal give and take. You know we in this shit together. You know we gonna we gonna grind out together. So don't expect don't don't just go in expecting a man to to to, to take your way through life. You know <clears throat> you know as a man they should be a protector and the provider. 
as and as a woman you should be a nurturer and carer and that's literally masculine and feminine energy right there <clears throat> one can't survive without the other it's, it'll be an imbalance so we need to be here we need to know we need to be here my black woman i gotta understand this my melanated queens out there right? you know ha stop having this toxic toxic to feminine toxicity of you know badass bitch give a fuck about a nigga and my th th that's the girls i'm talking about talking to i'm not talking to every black woman or melanated woman because i know it not every melanated woman is like that it's just uh, 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 the mainstream, how they put, uh, portray us in the media and shit. <clears throat> so, fem feminine toxicity, that a nigga can't tell you shit, oh, and um, you gotta buy me a Birkin bag. If you don't buy me a Birkin bag, I'm not being with you. That's toxic. You feel me? That's toxic. Like I said, I get on my men, I'ma get on my, I'ma get on the niggas, but I'ma get on y'all too. I'ma get on everybody. I'ma tell y'all each of y'all problems so we could come to a solution. So we be like, okay, let me heal here, let me heal here. And now we could me eye to eye understand have clarity and not pay attention to these lame ass celebrities programming us to be something we not what you like is not really what you like it's based off what you've seen and you thought you like if you never seen that shit you would never liked it in the first place think about that shit so if you was in your most natural state you wasn't programmed all your life you wouldn't even give a fuck about 95 percent of the shit you give a fuck about today but anyway you know, as a group, we gotta, we gotta get, we gotta get shit right. We gotta get shit right. And I love my black people. I love everybody, but specifically my black people. Y'all are, we are powerful, but we can absorb them. The sun, we can absorb them light coals. It give us energy. We can absorb that shit. We, we could get information from source energy, right? So, you know, we gotta get it together. And even in the industry, and, and the worst thing is. Even in the mainstream media, when they do portray a black woman in a, in a black man in a relationship, it's toxic bullshit. You feel me? It's baby boy ass shit. You know, baby boy shit on some uh uh uh, uh I like you, Jody. I like you. Feel me? That type of bullshit. Toxic shit. And, you know, and when you see black men and, and, and when they friends and shit, two black men is always a snake ass nigga, a chauncey ass nigga, uh niggas from Juice, <clears throat> Tupac. He played, you know, a snake nigga who killed his friend, all his friends, and tried to, like, feel me? So, this is what this society has deemed us. We don't have to deem us that. We can know that we are creators of, of our own reality. And we don't gotta, you know, bow down to nothing and shit. We in mass numbers, shit. We run this motherfucker, you feel me? But anyway, I don't wanna make this too long, but I, I just wanna put, put y'all on and, and, and really, shh, break shit down so y'all can truly understand you know so i love y'all hope y'all enjoy hope y'all learn something make sure y'all follow me at mills underscore dgaf it's gonna be on the screen somewhere thank you future me um <laughs> you feel me so that's about it i love y'all take care of yourself and i'm out